told me I would be nothing. You told me that I was just some loser born on the wrong side of the tracks. A peasant, as I recall it. A real life peasant. Racist against me because I'm Italian. Thinking I'm in the mafia. You never looked me in the eyes and observed my character, my makeup as a man. You judged me and criticized me and never gave me a fair chance. Had I not of olive skin, you would have given me that loan for my business. But I digress. Perhaps you would have laughed and waved me off as you did. Unless there was some large piece of a pie for you. Too large, I'm afraid. Always too large indeed. All that unnecessary stuff for what, Miss Emily? To prove what? That you're the stronger one? The dominant one? The one who calls all the shots? Hmm. Maybe you do. May you call the shots. One thing is certain though. This bit, this trip is not just any sort of visit. See, I'm a busy man these days. This is a business trip. You see, Miss Emily, I am making a purchase today. I am buying the entire town and everything in it, from the buildings to the lands they stand on, you see? I have swept the carpet from under you, you old hag! And I hope you love it another 15 years! Wondering what I'm gonna do next! You wretched old bat! You evil, crooked, spiteful woman! I've taken over your world and everything in it, and there's not a single thing you can do about it. This, this is your destiny, Miss Emily. For all those people you've ousted and put into ruins, they're all coming back. I have my men locating each and every one of them and their families. For all the wrong you have done has come to an end and will be set right by me, so help me God. Your evil display of tyranny has come to its final day. I am the new king around here. You have been dethroned.